Howdy, bestie viewers! Most of us take walking for granted. Day after day, we travel on foot to our various destinations. We walk everywhere, but we don't often realize just how valuable it is to our health. Little do we realize there are different postures and techniques that do different things for our body. In today's video, we'll talk about common types of walking and the health benefits they provide. What's power walking? What can it do for your health? What about a brisk walk? We'll talk about all of these and more. Number 1. The Leisurely Stroll A relaxed stroll is a popular walking style in most towns and cities. This sort of walk is used for exercise or to quickly get from one place to another. You won't get any cardiovascular benefits from this style of walking. This is because the legs are held at a relatively short side, putting less load on the heart. Leisure walking is more beneficial to your mental health than your heart. It's the type of stroll you go on when you need to get some fresh air, relax your thoughts, or simply take a break from a hard day. According to research, this walking style can help alleviate anxiety, despair, and bad mood. It can also improve self-esteem and alleviate social withdrawal symptoms. Number 2. The Strength Walk Power walking is an exercise style that stresses on speed and arm movements to improve your health. Regular power walking, when done correctly, is beneficial to your heart, joints, and emotional well-being. You need a good amount of energy to do it successfully, but it's possible. Power walks are particularly helpful for individuals who don't have excess body fat on their frames. Those who need to lose weight should consider doing it before going on these types of walks. Power walks can help your weekly fitness regimen as long as you're healthy and strong enough for it. Your body muscles are driven into intense activity when you power walk. If you're doing this walk, you'll experience fast breathing and sweat, which work together to release chemicals that boost stamina and lower the chances of disease. Your muscle strength will also grow over time, allowing you to complete physical tasks a lot quicker. According to studies, power walking lowers your chances of high blood pressure, high cholesterol, and diabetes. Don't forget to get the proper equipment. Your shoes should have a flat sole and sufficient arch. Make sure you walk on the sidewalk where you won't be hit by cars. Use reflective tape on your clothes or bring a flashlight if you're walking at dawn or in the dark. If you're new to this sort of walking, you should begin slowly and gradually increase your speed. You'll be astonished at how much you can do in such a short period of time if you put in the effort. Number 3. The Amble The amble is a gentle and easy-going walking style. This walk is typically linked with nature walks or casual holiday strolls. It can be used for exercise, although tempo isn't fast enough to benefit your heart. People who prefer this form of walking can do it in their surroundings and get away from the stress of daily life. These folks may also prefer lengthier hikes to escape civilization for a few hours. If you've been sitting at your office for an hour, you should take a five-minute break to recharge your batteries. Why not take a short walk to the kitchen to get a drink of water? Going on a stroll can improve your sleep quality. Studies show that regular physical exercise such as walking can enhance sleep quality by allowing people to fall asleep sooner and remain asleep longer. It can also help with sleep apnea, restless leg syndrome, muscular soreness, and Raynaud's phenomena. Before we move ahead, here's another video you might like. Are you looking for new ways to get in shape? Watch and learn why jump rope can help you lose weight faster than running. Now back to our list of different walking styles. Number 4. Steady Walk a steady stroll is a type of walking style that requires you to maintain a consistent speed. This is the most common form of walking on hiking routes. The steady walk, like the leisurely stroll, will not only give you a lot of cardiovascular advantage, it'll still be a fun exercise. This style of stroll allows hikers to rest without having to stop for too long or slow down too much. It allows them to move slowly until they're ready for something more difficult. If you think steady walking for exercise is dull, try it with a friend. You'll be able to talk just as much during a 30-minute steady walk as you would if you sat in a cafe. You can listen to music. You may also change where you walk to explore different parts of your neighborhood. Number 5. The Race Walking Hang on a second, isn't this running? No, just hear us out. If you want to gain muscle, burn calories, and compete athletically, race walking might be the style for you. A race walk has specific criteria. While the main objective is to go from one location to another, there are limits as to how this is accomplished. It's important to examine your race walking technique. Posture, arm movements, and unique stride are all examples of this. From the moment your front foot touches the ground until it passes under your torso, you keep your knee straight. You must always have one foot on the ground. 
This causes the hip rotation that is specific to race walking. Race walking is particularly good for burning fat deposits in the body because it needs regular movement at a fast rate. These chemicals are released into the bloodstream and used as fuel for muscles. The body burns a lot of calories, up to 200 per hour if the conditions are favorable. This makes race walking ideal for anyone trying to lose weight. Number 6. The Quick Walk A brisk stroll requires you to move at a reasonably quick speed. Because of how fast you'll be going, this style of walk needs the body's muscles to work harder. As a result, it delivers a modest, aerobic exercise while also allowing you to travel long distances in a short amount of time. Brisk walkers frequently wear lightweight sports clothing, such as shorts, thin shoes, and thin shirts. Some even wear similar garments in cold weather for convenience. Athletic apparel helps to keep perspiration away from the skin and allows air circulation throughout the body, which increases the aerobic advantages even more. A brisk walk several times a week might be beneficial to your health since it promotes endurance. If you're not sure if you're taking a quick walk, there are a few things you should pay attention to. First of all, brisk walks may make you feel breathless. At the same time, you should still be able to carry a conversation. While you don't exactly need to do this, it's recommended that you warm up before your walk and then cool down after. Number 7. Chi Walking Chi walking is an unusual approach to a traditional exercise practice that you may use to enhance your health. Chi walking combines ancient eastern techniques with the simple exercise of walking. This is done to develop the mind and the body. If you're a beginner with fitness, chi walking is just the exercise for you. It'll allow you to get a feel for physical cardio workouts. Over time, you'll get the hang of it, and you'll want to do more forms of exercise. Part of the usefulness of chi walking is developing body postures that'll give you the best results. Another aspect of the mindful approach is releasing the body and allowing it to be more adaptable. This way, it'll absorb pressure and deal with the obstacles that activities like walking and running impose on it. Chi walking is a type of meditation that'll help you relax your mind. It allows you to become more aware of your environments, as well as your body and mind. Breathing exercises are essential in mindful or chi walking and can help raise your mood. Walking is a great way to enjoy ideal health benefits. Begin with 5 to 10 minutes of walking 3 days a week and increase your walking time after a while. Let's keep the conversation going with a couple more exercise-related videos, shall we? Here's what you need to know. Try walking every day and see what happens to your body. You should also check out losing weight with these stomach exercises and a 21-day walking plan. Go ahead, click one, or better yet, watch both, and learn how the right workouts can improve your health. Are you a big walker? Would you consider any of these walks after watching this video? Let us know in the comments below!